Big Slick here with a carrier furnace repair video. This furnace was installed brand new in October of 2020 and as of today's date this is January of 2022 so in only 14 months there's already been a defect in this furnace which is quite disappointing. The manufacture date on this furnace was August of 2020. The model number of the furnace looks to be 58SB0A110 E21-20. The furnace was short cycling. It would only stay on for a minute or two, kick off, and then repeat the process. Doing a little bit of research here, it was flashing up on this light indicator down here, a code 31. You read it by the number of short uh, bursts of the lamp followed by a longer burst of the lamp. And so it would have three short lights and then a longer light. So that's a code 31. And it turns out to be a uh, the high pressure switch is tripping off. And so whenever I opened this up, I found that the fan on this small motor up here, the blade here, was laying down here in the bottom of the furnace. And so in other words, the, uh, the blades came off of the shaft of the motor here. And that was plenty enough to uh, cause this to trip off, obviously. And I can't even see how this was ever fastened on here from the factory. There's no obvious signs of some type of Starlock washer. There doesn't appear to be anything that ever fastened that. And certainly just pushing it on in friction was not going to hold this. So what I did was I just uh, put it on using some uh, minute epoxy. And I think it's going to be fine. If not, I'm going to pick up at the hardware store a uh, Starlock washer. But this is the weekend and it was 12 degrees overnight. So the goal here was to get this repaired as quick and efficiently as possible. And letting it set up for an hour. I don't think this is ever coming off of here anytime soon now. But in case the epoxy does fail... I'm going to throw a Starlock washer on it and it should be fine. In case you have one of these newer carrier furnaces and you're having a short cycle problem, take your front door off and look and see if this plastic uh, black fan blade is laying inside. Maybe this is going to, going to be a commonly known problem in these. Like I say, this is only 14 months old and it's in a very nice clean environment check it see if that might have happened to yours and you can fix it easily and cheaply yourself without having to call a technician tech technician especially on the weekend might charge you 150 dollars to do something like this well thanks a lot bye